Well, I did light the weeds on fire, but uh, we wanted to burn them anyway, so. <laughs> okay, y'all, this is the easiest way to take care of yellow jackets that I found. We're doing another video. There's another one on it, but this one hopefully might be a little bit better. I don't know. Either way, found another nest, and it is a big nest, I'm suspecting. So we're going to go over here. Let y'all see how big this thing is. So we're going to walk over here and go through the fence. Still a bunch of yellow jackets out here. All right, let's head over here. Let's see if they're going in and out that bad. It don't. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they are. This is how I found them. They're all over the ground too still. These things are starving. But here is the hole right underneath that rock. You can see them flying by me and right into it. Yeah, there is a big nest in there. So what I'm hoping is they ain't got another hole, which I don't think they do and that it goes straight down into the ground and not at an angle underneath that rock which shouldn't be no problem look at all them three of them just came in all at once and went in the hole look at them y'all probably sitting there hoping i get stung ain't you i ain't stepped on one yet they're still coming in and out though we're gonna wait till about dark the video is gonna look like crap but We'll get it somehow. That went right over top of my head, right beside my ear. But man, they are flying everywhere. That is definitely a pretty good nest. I ain't digging this one up to show y'all or anything. That, you know, I'd you know, be a little bit lazy here and there, you know what I mean? Could do it with a little trico, but I don't feel like it. Would like to see, I ain't never dug one up to just see the size of the nest, but maybe sometime and there's another hornet so there is a big old hornet's nest bald face hornet right there flying around he's actually what is he doing is he seriously going down in carry you don't need to go in there oh he ain't screwing around now he'll take them out that's crazy he's attacking them check it out carry move move get out of there get out of there get out of there girl man he's going in and out of that hole he just went in it He's going in to attack the nest. Oh, I never seen this before. There he is. Maybe he wasn't in the nest. He was eating one of them or something. I thought he went inside the nest. Where'd he go? I don't want to get hit by one of them, man. They hurt. Yellow jackets ain't got nothing on that sucker. That makes a couple of them I've seen today. I don't think he's coming back. He might have took off and ran with that thing. But as uh, long as you don't find their nest, they'll be all right. Either way, I'm going to head over here and uh, get the gas lane. We'll wait for it to get a little bit more darker, and we will get this started. Let me see what all I'm going to do here. Uh, okay, we'll, we'll light this when I bring some water out and light it. Man, look at that. Three at once just went in that hole. And a bunch of yellow jackets. A bunch of them. I'm hoping this is the main nest because uh, kind of a little worry about holding your mouth open out here. Pretty well keep it closed, don't talk, you know what I mean? <laughs> it buzz by your head so fast. I'm assuming that hornet's nest plenty, plenty far enough out of here. Well, let's go ahead and uh, get the gasoline anyways. All right, y'all, it's dark, so we are going to go over here. I got a lot of light out here. I, I, get scared of the dark real easy so either way we're gonna go over here and spot out these yellow jackets see if they're coming in and out which they should not be we got our gasoline jug we're gonna walk on through here like i said the video probably ain't gonna be very good but let's go over here see if we can spot them out should be able to where's a rock I can't remember where it was, y'all. Let me see. I think it was right here. Right here. I didn't mark it this time. Oh, yeah. There they are. Right there. Okay. So we're going to get this set up. Let's see if anybody's coming in and out. There ain't nobody on guard either. Yeah, they ain't even on guard. All right. We'll get this. Okay. Let's get the gas ready.
All right, y'all, time to head in here and uh, get this started. Now, we got a better gas jug here. This is one of the old ones. Used to have a little vent cap right there. That way the gas goes in real quick. There's no stupid little valve right there. You want the gas to flow real quick. But either way, we're going to go in here and start dumping gas. I don't see nobody on lookout. Oh, yeah, I do. Oh, there's a whole crap load of them right there on lookout. Okay. That's fine. We got you. Make sure it's going in the hole. Oh, yeah, going in the hole. That's another big one. It's sucking it right down in there. Ain't going nowhere else but in the hole. And they are had. Now, when you have them come out on another hole on you one time, y'all will be like uh, a little bit nervous, but uh, I wouldn't worry about it too much at night. They're pretty much, pretty much had. And if y'all really want to light it, which we're going to do, I don't think we'll catch a hillside on fire. Just put your little stream back. That way you don't burn yourself. At least you didn't shave today and you want to just like, you know, take care of some uh, leg hairs. Okay, I don't really see where we're going to burn anything. I already tried to light it with a lighter. But let's go ahead. I'll put this screw back in. And we will light this booger up. Got a little gasoline. Here, I'll turn off the light. That way, uh, let me see, where is it? That way y'all can uh, get a better view of it. Okay, that's a doll light there, so that one should be fine. Here we go. Y'all ready? Three, two, one. Well, I did light the weeds on fire, but uh, we wanted to burn them anyway, so <laughs> as long as the hillside don't go up, we will be okay. Oh, I didn't feel like mowing that anyways, y'all. What do y'all think? You think we took them out? I think we took them out. We're going to let this burn for just a little bit. But y'all just be careful when y'all do this, not to catch a hillside on fire, you know, or yourself. But like I said in the last video, you have not got to light this. I could have just went inside and said, forget it. And I didn't want to stand in the middle of it this time. But, uh, I mean, I could have just went inside and just said, forget it, you know, and they, they would have been taken care of. But now this thing's going to burn for a little while, but I'm probably going to go over and put it out with my foot. I should be able to smother it here after it dies down here in a minute. But I just like flame, I guess, you know, I got two burn piles of light down there. Next time it rains, I am definitely lighting them. I like just enjoying it, sitting outside and watching the fire. Ain't much of a fire right here. Heck, I might go, you know what? I'm gonna go over here and build, build a little fire and tiny little fire pit I got and roast some marshmallows here in just a few. I'm bored. I hear crickets and Katie dids. Yep, I hear a whole bunch of them. But as you see, it didn't catch hillside on fire. Like I said, I already took a lighter and tried to burn some of the grass. It lighted a little bit, and I was like, ah. Moisture out here is real good. It rained day before yesterday, so all the ground's still wet. Really wasn't worried about it too much. I've had a lot of fires up here. Well, there y'all go. That is how you take out yellow jackets. Y'all waiting for me to go over and stomp that, though, ain't you? I'll go over there here in just a second. Ah, oh, man. The hornet's nest was a little more interesting, but uh, there wasn't no flame involved, y'all. I, I still got to, I ain't put that video out. I don't know which one I'm going to put out first, this one or the other one. Probably the other one. If y'all would like for me to do more of these, let me know. If I find any more yellow jackets, I'll throw them on there. Heck, I might just record it anyway, say so heck with it. Anything we found. Heck, I went walking around today for about two, three hours just trying to... Um, Find more yellow jackets nest after I found this one because this can't be the only one. But we'll find out tomorrow how much these yellow jackets have gotten knocked down and then I'll have to go find another nest. 
there, there's at least I would say two more definitely two more there was one year I had uh, five nests over here on the right it within a 35 foot area that that was that was bad and I missed them I weeded the whole area and somehow did not get hit by them but when it knocked them all out with gasoline just like we did right here I didn't light it though I don't think I can't remember it's been a while that's probably about five six years ago maybe longer we'll find out tomorrow if they had a another exit hole that, that's few and far between usually that's a giant nest that has an exit hole like two exit holes and entrance holes and those are some big nests which this one was big it's just weird they were all coming out the same hole and i'll probably probably record tomorrow and see how many less yellow jackets there is out here tomorrow show it for y'all and uh, put it all together somehow on this doggone thing. I'm getting better at editing, sort of. <laughs> Not really, but it's okay. As long as y'all are watching my videos, it don't matter, does it? I gotta make them halfway interesting. I ain't doing very good, I don't think, but it's okay. We'll try to get some better ones. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and stomp this out, y'all. Oh, there was another hole. Check this out. Oh, oh, three holes. Look at this. Okay, let me show y'all. This is pretty good. You can see the flame shooting through it. That's the only reason I noticed. Let's get this off here. Check this out. I dumped it down in that one. This one has a flame here. Let me turn this, turn the flash off. Hold on a minute. Okay, now you can see. There's, there's the hole I dumped it in. There's the hole it ran to. And look at this. Here's another hole. And look, there's a crack right there, a big old hole. Look at that. Holes everywhere. Here, I'll back it up a little bit. Well, y'all can see them all. Look at that. A whole bunch of them. I ain't getting that put out. It's just gonna have to keep on burning. Cause uh, yeah, I'll show y'all one more time. Entrance hole, secondary hole. Oh, burning my camera apparently. Secondary hole, that's a big hole right there. That thing's two and a half inches. I'll show y'all tomorrow on the thing too. And there's another giant hole. Right there it goes up in there. Look at that. It is burning good down in there. I should get a better better view of it. There we go. That goes way down in there. And here's another one. That crack goes all the way through there. I'm probably moving the camera a lot on you, but that, that's neat. I ain't never seen this before. That is definitely neat. There we go. Now we can see. Look at that. Man, that was a that was probably a huge nest. Huge nest. Hopefully that wiped everybody out in the yard. I hope. Let me turn on the light and see if there was any uh exits or if that was just like holes in the ground for an emergency or something. I don't see where it's really cleared out there. I just see where it's cracked. And a big old hole with the fire. Let's see about that one. I don't know. I don't really see where they had anything cleared out of them. Maybe it was just emergency exits or something. But it's definitely all linked. All right, y'all. That is going to be it on this one. Just figure I'd show you. I'm going to stay out here for a while on this one. Well, y'all like the blue flame? I like the blue flame. All right, y'all, we're going to go over here. We're going to check, see how many yellow jackets is in the yard. And we're going to go over here and see if we took out the yellow jackets. I'm sure there's another nest around here, but let's walk around and find out, see what we got. Okay, this is the next day, and we still have a lot of yellow jackets. See them all flying around there? And it's right here in the front yard. I'll show you how far it is from the, I mean, they're, they're all over the place. 
ton of them. So we're going to track them down. We're going to try to find another nest. One just landed on my hand. And I'm going to show you all how far it is from the nest I took out. We're going to go over and double check it. And that is it. Right over there on the other side of the gate, about 20 foot, is where the other nest is. So, but the yellow jackets, looks like we'll check them on the way back. I don't know. Let's look over here, see, see if they uh, straighten. Nope, they're all the way over here, too. Not as bad as they were. So, y'all might think they're keep on coming back, but they ain't. They are just gone. And these are another nest. And they're still all the way over here. So let's see, there's one flying around, two, three. There is definitely another nest here somewhere. They ain't coming in out of the hole. So the hole is done, but the nest is definitely around here somewhere. Show you all this during the daytime anyway, it's pretty neat. And they were not coming out of there, but that's where one of the flames was. Had another one right there where that crack is. And there's that big old hole right there. And here is the one we dumped the gasoline down. That one had all the blue flame on it last night. But there are no more yellow jackets coming in and out of that one. So what we gotta do is track down another nest. <sighs> see how many more we got. And but as you see, there's yellow jackets all over the place over here still. Definitely hard to track them. I, I wouldn't be surprised if there's another nest like 10 15 foot from this one so i'm gonna sit here for just a few and look at it but other than that that's gonna be it y'all i'll see if i can't find some more to do y'all enjoy have a good day we will see you all on next one